Hey guys, it's David from TheUnlocker.com. Today we're going to show you how to enable USB storage on your Windows Phone 7 device. So first, before you begin, a uh, few things. Just be careful when you change stuff in the registry. Make sure that you only change the registry entries that we mention here, just to avoid uh, changing some things on your computer that you didn't want to. Uh, second, you need to install the Zune software from Microsoft. You can get that here by clicking on that link. Once you've downloaded and installed that, then you need to plug your phone in. Um, once it's completely done installing Zune and it'll start to install the drivers for the phone and you'll also notice Zune will pop up automatically just close it once you've set up your phone and then we can continue from there okay once we're all set up we can begin to edit the registry so we're going to click on our start menu type in regedit reg edit and you'll see regedit.exe come up I'm gonna click that now you're going to, on the left here, it'll start out kind of like that. You're going to find each key local machine, click on the arrow, then system, click on the arrow, current control set, arrow, enum, and then USB, and then click on the USB and highlight that, and then we're going to go edit, find, and we're going to type in Zune driver, one word, capital Zune, capital driver, click find, It'll pop up with something here. So when you look over down here, you'll see this is the identification for your device. So it found Zoom Driver in this folder, so we're going to go up a folder to Device Parameters. Then it'll give you all of these options that we're about to change. Okay, now we're going to make our changes. So we're going to, inside this folder here, we're going to first start with Show in Shell. So right click that, Modify change the value from 0 to 1, hit OK, and we're looking for portable device name space exclude from shell, space exclude from shell, that's that one, okay, so right click, modify, change from 1 to a 0, which basically means we're turning it off, and then enable a legacy support, modify, change from a 0 to a 1, Click OK. Now we can close the registry editor. Okay, now when you plug the phone back in, the Zoom software will open up. Let me hit skip. Close the Zoom software. You should be able to go to your regular thing here and find the HTC, HD7, or whatever your phone's name is, open the storage, and you'll be able to throw stuff in there. Uh, and it's easy now, you just drag and drop just like it was a USB storage device, so enjoy!